So this is a fun little um, dance app called Toka Dance. This could be really, really beneficial for kids that are designing basically their own dance. And um, basically they could do it uh, virtually, so they could do it through this app and then they could actually act it out and do it for real. So you can see here, um, there's a little bit of a spill as we go through. So I'll just show you through. We'll press, press play straight away. Now I'll select a character just quickly. And then you can obviously dress up costumes and you can get into all that sort of stuff, which I'll kind of skip over. Just go to the next part here. And you can see here, I've turned the music down, but it's got a little beat going. And basically what we do is we actually kind of move the actual arms and you can see that it just replicates that in a bit of an order. And then when we click on the next one, which is the yellow one here, we could actually do a bit of a shuffle there and a shuffle there and so forth and it's recording what we do. And it's got there. And when we've finally finished, we just go to the new one and send it all to there, plays it with some music, puts all of the things together, and we go from there. So if I just press play, I won't dress them up at all. And then you can see here, there's a little bit of a beat which you can't hear. It's got all the actions that we've designed and it's got all the movements there, which is really, really fun. Great, cool little way of getting kids to design their own dance. And then obviously they could act it out afterwards and actually do it together and in groups. A fun little app, good little application for dance and design. Um, and you could also work in algorithms and you could work in um, like a sequence of dance steps too. You could kind of integrate that a little bit as well. Hope you found that interesting. Paul Hamilton signing off.